on our next beer here. Wasaga Beach One. This is Beach One Cerveza. And what's it say here? It says Beach One Cerveza. Beach One is the strip of Wasaga Beach where the sand and the sun lovers cruise to see and be seen. When it gets a little bit hot, grab a Beach One Cerveza. Okay, let's see, it's 4.5% alcohol. These little flies are biting like crazy. Not bad. It's got a little different taste in it, but I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. Okay, here we go. Another beer. This is Burst Beer by Great Lakes Brewery out of uh, Toronto. It is 4.5% alcohol. It is a New England Pale Ale. And this session, I bought beers that look really cool. That's why I bought them. I haven't done them before. So it's got here, our planet under threat by an unseen enemy of bland tasting beer is once again saved by the hops rocket of our unsung hero so we're gonna give her a try and see what we think my last beer got a thumbs up before i even tasted it i could smell the hops you know it's not that bad it's not too strong but let me take a second test Okay, an English New England Pale Ale. A little bit smoother than your normal Indian Pale Ale. So, hang it. It's not my kind of beer, but I'll give it a, one of these. Okay, we have a Muskoka Craft Lager. I don't know if I've had this one before or not. It, uh, well, Muskoka Breweries. And it is, uh, what is it? It is 4.8% alcohol. Um, I like lager, so. Not bad. Good for a walk in the bush. Cheers, thumbs up for it. Well, here, for another beer, it's this, this beautiful Saturday, it is, I believe. We got a Nickel Brook, Nickel Brook, Brewing Company, Naughty Neighbor, American Pale Ale. Get out of my way. 4.9 for 4.9% alcohol. Really, I haven't had that much to drink. Um, let's give it a try. Down to the science, it says. Those little flies. It's a pale ale, but in American isn't as strong as an Indian pale ale, I find, so. I'm gonna give it one of these. It's not bad for a pale ale. This is a honey lager. So, this is out of Perth, Ontario, Perth Brewery. Honey lager, 4.5% alcohol. This is what it has to say. Wet your thistle. Taste this thistle flower, this bright and lively honey lager. Local beer, bees buzz this beer with the subtle flavor of countless field trips to the backwoods. What can we say? It's a bee's knee. I don't quite get it, but let's try it out here. I've never had this beer before. Not bad. Thumbs up. Cool.